second tour in Kelowna's cultural district. It's a six block area in downtown Kelowna. Easy access to art galleries, museums, theaters. This is the Art Art Gallery, a great building and incredible space. It actually was once a printer's warehouse and a cannery, and now it's an art gallery, one of many you can find in the cultural district. The cultural district may be the hub of the Kelowna art scene, but it doesn't stop there. Garrett Mass is one Kelowna artist whose work is exhibited in the cultural district and in more than 30 countries worldwide. Visitors can enjoy his sculpture garden at his home gallery in Kelowna. The art scene in Kelowna is much more diverse than when we came here, which is 28 years ago. Uh, you had uh, one uh, museum and an art gallery that was part of the museum. But now we even have a cultural district. Some people make the differentiation between an urban playground or a bohemian village. Now, I would have to say we're right in the middle. We do have the larger institutions, public ones, like the Kelowna Art Gallery, uh, the Kelowna Museums, the Kelowna Community Theatre, and we have the Rotary Centre for the Arts with tons of artist studios inside of it, which are all great. But we also have the funky independent boutiques throughout the area. Shiloh Verhagen creates her one-of-a-kind stained glass necklaces, bracelets and earrings in her shop that doubles as her gallery in downtown Kelowna. I actually have had a lot of women phone me to say that they wore their jewelry out to a function and they've never had so many compliments before. Even they say, I wear my diamonds and no one has ever commented on the jewelry. So it's nice when women can really get a piece that really does reflect their personality because you can really see it. Women are one of a kind, so jewelry should be one of a kind. Being downtown, it's definitely, there is a community here and we all bounce customers off of each other and I mean we all have such great individual stuff that it definitely is a different type of shopping atmosphere down here where you go in and you're, you know, nine times out of ten you're actually talking to the business owner. The flower stores, the art shops, the clothing stores are fantastic. The reason that I chose downtown to open up a boutique is that there's some heritage downtown and I actually occupy a space that used to be the Kelowna Opera House and then after that it was the only place to shop. My landlord just came and brought me this burnt cinder block from our original space and it just, it's so great and I love modernizing it with that same old school vibe. The old and the new come together in downtown Kelowna's cultural district weaving a unique fabric between urban playground and bohemian village. Whether it's a home decor place like Functional, or antique shops, or Chai Baba Tea House, it's all here. And so I'd have to say, we have the best of both worlds.